Hello, my name's Esther McVeigh and I'm the Minister for Employment and Conservative MP for Wirral West. I'd like to thank Fairtrain for inviting me uh, today to your event and also Sky for hosting it. And first off, happy Work Experience Week. Now, I'm terribly sorry I can't be there in person, but uh, parliamentary duties call, and that's democracy in action, so I've got to stay in the House today. But by the wonders of technology, I'm being able to beam myself into your event. And I have to say, it has to be one of the most important events at the moment, and that's helping people with work experience and helping young people uh, get a job. Because what do young people tell me up and down the country? They need uh, work experience to get a job, but they need a job to get work experience. I mean, how do we solve that problem? Well, it's with helpful employers and helpful work advisors at uh, Job Centre Pluses really sorting uh, this out. And since January 2011, we've managed to have over 250,000 such places. All are employment driven, all are work focused and all are industry led. Some are sector based work academies and some are work experience. And what have we found out from those opportunities? Well, 80% of young people say they think it's improved their prospects. 75% said it's increased their confidence. And most importantly, 42% have got a job at the end of that placement. That really is impressive and shows that work experience works. And what I'd like to say, I know that our young people are some of the most driven, talented and innovative in the world. So if we can help young people like this, well then that to me is really important. And also what we've seen this month, which I'm really pleased about, is that youth unemployment has fallen by the biggest rate since records began. That really is impressive. And the number of young people claiming job seekers allowance is lower than at pre-recession levels. So I want to wish you all a very good uh, work experience day and week. I want to thank once again Fairtrade and also uh, great companies like Sky who are really making this happen.